the last time I was around a campfire outside at night, Abraham and some of the kids from church were having a sleep out, a sleepover out in these igloo things they built. Uh huh. I can't remember what the name was. It was very interesting though. Like winter? Yeah, it was winter camping. Ooh, wow. It was in the dead of winter, and one of the fellows stayed up all night and tended the fire. And they had these these domes, and they had um, dug the dome. They they piled snow into a huge mountain, and they let it sit for a few hours, so it would settle and freeze, I guess. And then they tunneled into it, and oh, they stuck through the outside. They they measured, you know, one foot or nine or ten inch long pieces of uh, poles, sticks. And they put them straight through the walls. And then they started digging, tu uh, they tunneled the inside out, dug it out. And when they hit those little sticks, they knew how thick the wall was. So they just stopped digging. Smart, eh? Those Canadians. Winter yeah. Camp. Yeah, I don't think I really feel like winter camping. <laughs> I have my teepee. This is the first campfire I've had outside in a long time. I have them in the teepee, you know. Well, we did have one about five years ago, I'd say. Well, at our it house? Was, uh, at your house, it was the ritualistic sacrifice of the chicken shed. <laughs> You were there for the chicken shed. Oh, the, the conflagration. <laughs> they keep telling that story. Were you there for the chicken shed or just for the... The, the burning of the... Ooh, ooh, the couch. The couch. You burnt the couch. Ooh, the couch. That was entirely was it one you. one or two? It was one That was couch. unbelievable how that thing went up. I know. That, that was, was scary. entirely his thing. It's like, who thing? nobody his buy thing. it. Uh, you burned down the chicken shed. I mean, you weren't there for the chicken shed, were you? <laughs> Tish was there. Yeah, it was me and Tish and Mom. I, maybe you were there because you were there the next day. So well, you remembered it, do you? I mean, you remember. I remember insane flames. Uh huh. Like billowing out. And up on the hill. I think you saw pictures. But you were definitely there the next day when you realized. So maybe you were there for that. Next day you got into it and and burnt the couch all by yourself. And by that time I was so upset because we had burnt this chicken shed which was full of straw, and the straw was covered in manure, and under, on top of new manure, and the whole thing was just one big bomb ready to go off. Well, you see, because on the inside of the chicken shed, it was so very kindling-like, you know. No, but any wooden full of building is so manure, dry. It's just unbelievably flammable. That's it's like good. pouring gas on it. It was one big pile of gas. Hmm. You know that manure is flammable, right? It's all methane. I guess so. This is it. Like in the olden days, I That's remember That's why my it was a fire that was 12 feet high. Could have been a, well, my was, siblings was tell me tall. when they were, you know, in that village out there the war, tree. there were 12 kids on the farm. The poor, poor farmer almost died of a heart attack because he had to watch the kids not, you know, doing anything crazy. Oh. And one day, some one of them, whatever, how it happened, set the, the uh, manure pile on fire. <laughs> Which yeah. again is like it's full of gas. It's oh, so it was that bad. They they managed to, to you know. To wow. To put it out. Yeah, to put it out. And he was he was certainly very upset, you know. Wow. The day he had to put hot shit on the field. Do you remember that? <laughs> <laughs> Do you remember that? The whole thing now is, is it wouldn't light. Uh, <laughs> the chicken shed wouldn't light. And it's full of, um, full of this, uh, straw on the top. Mm -hmm. And so, Mom comes over with a container of gas. No! You did. <laughs> I it did not. Light. It wouldn't light. You came over with gas from, I from, from the... I would not. You did. From the um, lawnmower, and you tossed some gas on it, and finally it lit a little bit. And the whole time I was just sitting there freaking out. I did not. This is going to be bad. 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 And what was it? It was the most humongous flame I have ever seen. It was so big, the trampoline was ruined, the cars almost blew up. It was dreadful. <laughs> it was so bad. Oh. And then you were like, ah, oh, i got to take care of the cars. And so you left. You got in your cars and you left. And you left me and Tish to deal with the whole thing. So Tish was in a car the, and the, I was the in the other car. Guard, what do you no, call it? The, you the, and yeah. Willem were in a car. Ranger. No, me Tish and Tish. Me. Willem was attending the little tiny well, fire. The, the, the water yeah? bombs, you know? No. <laughs> All of a sudden, well, on the house. <laughs> <laughs> roof came down. 
cave. Look, you have any idea something. how big that was? Mm. This is the size of that tree, Mum. That tree right there. A maple. A baby humongous. It was a very big flame. It was uh, unbelievable. And I didn't and even... it was close to the house, too. Way too close. I it, think it was this about this far from the house. And the, the fire was the size of that And it's tree. a wooden house. Oh, yeah, of course. Yeah. It wasn't that close to the house. <laughs> it was! It's on the edge of the driveway. How far is the driveway from your house? All right, maybe it was. Two meters to the driveway, maybe three. And then how wide is your driveway? Five meters? Mm-hmm. I do not approve of fire. The tank is small places on top of cement, and that's it. Especially around Nancy today. Crazy! Cement foundation? No, I'm sorry. Uh -uh. <laughs> Don't draw him around fires either. He's the one Anyway, I meant to fire. say that this platform is perfect for many things. Mm -hmm. And definitely for making a fire. Because mm -hmm. I think it's much more romantic sitting out here in the, in the forest in a way, you know, mm -hmm. than sitting right beside the house. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. I like it.